Well, welcome to the Election Command Centre. The New Patriotic Party has begun the vetting of some 30 aspirants in the western region ahead of the party's parliamentary primaries, slated for April 25. Aspirants from seven um, out of the scheduled 13 constituencies were Sunday vetted. The vetting committee first vetted two aspirants from Amenfi East. Aspirants from Pristia Huni Valley were next. The incumbent Member of Parliament and Minister of Tourism, Creative Arts and Culture, Barbara Otin Jesse is on a national assignment and has sought permission from the committee for a voting to be done at a later date. Other aspirant, Theophilus Tariato TV3, the voting went smoothly. I've been a member of this party since 2000. I've been very active at the party level and at the national level. And I've also been active in the constituency level. So I'm putting myself up to represent the people of Pristia. As a lawyer, I bring development to the people. And I, I pray that they give me the chance to go to the process. The third voting was that of the aspirant from Takwa and Suyayim. Incumbent MP Mreku Duka was the first to be voted. They put the uh, rules and regulations of the party uh, to bear. Uh, they asked, oh, what are your strategies, what you can do to support the party and so on. Uh, these are things, I mean, that are very simple for us. For close to an hour, Executive Director of NGO, Joy Foundation, Joyce Lane Ando, was before the voting committee. Apparently, she had to answer five petitions against her. I believe that I have served my people well. I mean, I have lived in Takwa and so I'm born there, schooled, worked there, and I've served the people. I have an NGO that has taken care of a lot of people, widows, the aged, and the street children. So for me, I believe that leadership is all about serving. The Western Regional Secretary of the Party, Child Bisu, told the news team, as parents who were not successful at the constituency and the regional levels, work led to be voted at the national level. We have received petitions from almost every constituency that... All the, all the 13 constituencies? Exactly. No, I mean, not all the 13. What we've done so far, we have received petitions for them. And they border on? Disqualification.